pay me dollar. They don't do that, I don't think. And you have to look around at the, uh, you know, which star source the Pokemon cards. Uh, Dower Tree is one of the consistent ones. Because, you know, all the Dower Swords are holding out all the, you know, super good cards. Alright, Spurlob has got Sheldon against the ropes here. His corner control, very strong. He's proven in the past he's been able to do it before. He can do it again. Ooh, sit down, son. Tattoo's no good here. Ah, Sheldon is on point with his shore use, always has been. Jump in, light kick. When's it coming? Just gonna risk it. Oh, okay. I can't believe she tech that. Yo. Yeah, that wasn't even a late tech. Tough to, it is tough to anti-air a character who can change their uh, jump trajectory uh, so much as Cammy can. Uh, even oh, yeah. if you do have a, a sure you can, when you're down on life like that, uh, even if you do throw it out, it can trade, and I think that's what Spabobin was hoping for. Ooh, I like that. Gets out trade. You gotta stuff her out of that, because if not, uh, she is positive. Oh, <laughs> look at that. Look at that dance he does. Sheldon use the hitbox? Doing the that quick? Uh, I, 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 hmm, I can't remember if he does or not. I was I know I was told once, and I believe the answer is yes, but I can't recall exactly. Nope. Not a safe jump against this Ryu, please. Yo, combos. So much oh, damage. No, I would have liked to have seen the standard kick. Okay. Oh, there you go. Oops, Bob and stealing that round. That crouch medium kick. There it is. That's what I wanted to see. Alright, it's Bob and up one. That good meaty setups. Sheldon knows his meaty setups. I think he has like a whole written out list for it somewhere in the Oh yeah, you don't jump against him when he's doing that that little shimmy. All he's doing is just buffing. I see, I don't know if that that jump uh early medium kick was intentional. Uh it ended up working as an air to air, but I think he was looking for a dive kick. Whatever he's doing, he's getting the damage out. He's not letting Sheldon do his crazy Sheldon stuff. That Ooh. is unfortunate. <laughs> that could have been it. Oh, got him. Very unfortunate for Sheldon in that particular set. Some weird drops there. Spacing on Spiral Arrow. Oof, gotta love it. anti is from, from downtown. Uh oh, oh no jump. crush counter. Empty jump shrinks your hurt box, man. Sometimes when you jump from max range and your opponent expects you to hit a button, you can make their anti air whiff, especially if they're very vertical anti air. Oof. Don't make you choose. For oh, look at that buffering. See, I like that because then Spavabin remembered that from the last time it happened. And he didn't try to advance in any way because he knew that Sheldon was ready, which then gave Sheldon the opportunity to dash forward and put himself in a better neutral position. Very smart. The one thing I just don't understand is that Spavabin's not going for any crush counters. Against what? Spavabin's not using any crush counters, and he's not punishing those DPs as 
well as he should be. So, the tough thing against Cammy's DP is that when she recovers, what he wants to really do is hit her with a standard hard kick as a crush counter, but... No, I'm talking about, you know, Cammy not utilizing, you know, Ryu's DPs on Sheldon. Oh, uh, well that would be because Cammy's crush counter sucks. There's Couldn't she team. still get, like, a little extra damage though? Even just a little bit. It has, like, no range. It's really bad. Really? Yeah, it's bad. That's unfortunate. She's better off just, like, punishing the fuck forward heavy kick. That's just still not a lot of damage. Not surprising for her. You'd think that she'd be able to, you know, really get on top of him. Love that view reversal. It really can turn things around. It's one of the better view reversals. Ooh, missed times Ooh. the throw. This is a little bit too early. Oh, good bait. Uh. There's your crush counter combo, and there's yeah. your stun, and there's your round. So Bobbin will be moving on to losers finals. To f wait, uh, are we there yet? No, not yet. Losers semis, uh, which we will get to in a minute. We are actually going to hop back up to winners finals right now. We're gonna get Blood Swarm and NKB in here. This is gonna be a good one. I'm ready for this. Yeah. Two very strong players. They've faced off each other against each other in the past. Um, Bloodswarm a very strong Fang and NKB a very strong Ken player. Um, what else? What else? What else? I guess we'll. See. I don't know. I, I'm not showing you the bracket right now. I'm like in it, kind of looking around. But yep, yeah. here we are in winners finals and down here. Waiting in the wing, we're gonna have Spababin and Zeta Zeta to play out losers semis before we get to losers finals. Um, that means I have to change the battle lounge settings to first three. Drop out to the back of the queue. Alright, good stuff. And folks, I just want to keep give you guys a quick reminder that if you are looking to enter this tournament, the, the tournament of the day will always be sticky right at the top. Uh, we've also got little announcements here on the side, and check out the calendar here uh, for regular FGC events and stuff that we're holding um, from week to week. Uh, but otherwise, signups will be listed sticky right at the top. Click on that, boom, and you just sign up here if you want to. If you're wanting to join the East Coast tournament right after this, which uh, sh I think the check-in has just opened, actually, since it's past ten. Yeah, check-in has just opened, uh, and you can just join right there. Uh, that will not be streamed. We do not have a uh, West Coast stream team quite yet. Working on it though, so. More information later. Uh, Fang's jumping is far too floaty uh, for him to get away with jump ins like that. Especially against MKB. We'll see if Blood Swarm can be super aggressive against MKB here. Oh, God. This is just aggression versus aggression here. Second time. Done that in two matches. Trying to get on the Man dash is right out of danger. The disrespect Ooh. from this man. Can't Ken autocorrect if Fang does a uh, cross-up slide? 
Yeah, he could. If he wants to. Fong can also... I mean, that wouldn't... He can bait that. And... Get a punish. It's not guaranteed. Ooh, look at that counter hit confirm. Oh, man. All those blocks, though, on that overhead? Very nice. This is going to be tough for him. And again, blocking the overhead. Very smart blocks from Bloodsworn, but not quite enough to take it. NKV going up one. Keep in mind, folks, because this is winner's finals, this matchup is best of five. So they're going to be playing a longer set uh, than the rest of the tournament. Before we hop on down to Losers Semis and Round then one. Losers Finals, which again will be best of five. Oof. Disrespect. So I like that because a lot of people, a lot of Fongs, will take advantage of the plus two frame advantage on block from the, the breakdance. So why not just disrespect it? Just say, nah, I, I, I know you're going to jab after that, but no, not today. Not tonight, so. Got to keep Fang in his place. Doesn't work in the corner. Got, got to work remind him. Got to remind him that, just you know, do it again. ain't no like place for Yo, high tiers here. MK, these shorties, though. These shorties, God. though. He was just busting them out. Why the hell not? Uh, pretty good reason not to. I'll tell brink. you that. <laughs> I mean, he was on the brink of dying anyway. Why not? So many. Not getting punished for it like three times in a row. I love it. Top tier diamond strats. From downtown. And again, the shimmy. Someone's about to get stunned. Ooh. Going for hard DX, reads. More DX dive kick there. And then NK be very high on life, but all oh, of that poison might only need two minutes. I love, I like that. A very strong confirm, sweet punish. I like it. Nah, that poison is not enough. NKB. Going up. Making it one all. <laughs> I, oh, think, God. I think NKB was expecting Blood Swarm to uh, command dash out of there. And maybe get the punish with the medium punch. Sure, you can, but not tonight. Not right now. So he was trying to bait it there again because NKB has gone a little bit. I like that. Do that from far out. Lose all your stun. Don't have to worry about it. Get out of pressure. Who cares? Yeah, Fang is pretty easy to. He's at, or I should say, he's pretty hard to stun because he's got so many tools to, you know, keep someone out once he gets some space in between him and his uh, opponent. Ooh, boy. All right. Got tied up. NKB, if I see any more shore use from you, that'll make me happy. I'll scorn you in the moment, but then later on I'll go, you know what? That was that was alright. Good cross up, good punish. Got max damage for no meter. I like it. NKB just staying patient, taking the poison. No need to take risks, but look at that gray health. The gray health does not go down when you are poisoned. It I didn't realize down. that. Interesting. That, that makes. Oh, yeah, it's. Fong is, is weird. He's a weird character. A pixel left. 
Not for that overhead, though. Round two. Fight. Ooh, just a punch on it. I like it. It's young Ken, though. Box the cross under. Stays patient. A lot of fangs go for that sweep, and it has crazy range, actually. It does. It's really... It comes up mad fast, too. Crazy range, but then sometimes doesn't hit on the, the part that would knock down, which is really unfortunate. Ooh, that's sure you will. Not this time. But you's no good here. Okay, I'm taking all that poison. V-trigger. Oh, I'm just gonna jump in just like that for free? Build all that meter? Do all that damage? Again? Again? And no anti-air attempts. I feel like NKB could or should be taking more advantage of that, of just approaching from the air, because it seems as though... Okay. The Blood Swarm is having a little trouble with that. I don't know if it's finding the right button or not being confident that Ken won't go for a dive kick. Well, as I say that, it gets a jump in the Empires with a standing medium kick. So, good stuff. Blood Swarm's yeah. Unless he's just having issues with that. Oh, no. Sure, you he just can stop get that right shimmy. there. Now you're in the corner. Uh, now he's out Stays of the corner. I don't think we're seeing enough cross up here. No? You know, just the 10 that went down in the past 5 seconds. Ooh, uh, we've deep. seen that before from Blood Swarm, and I don't think I've ever seen anyone block it. Yeah, so deep. I, I just don't think I've ever seen anyone block it. It's it's a weird situation where he, he throws out that poison bowl, then uses the command dash to get very far away, and then jumps over you for another cross-up. So, like, you have to block the first poison ball the way that he starts the command dash, Round the one. second one the other way. Fight and then block the cross-up like a cross-up, so you're switching the stick back and forth if you're blocking the whole time. It's actually really, really difficult if you're not used to seeing it, and I don't think I've ever seen anyone block it. At least in this tournament. Oh, a lot of people go for sweeps against Fong uh, when he throws out the poison balls. Uh, Oh, Blood Swarm. It was NKB who went up early, but now Blood Swarm is one match away from sending NKB down to losers. Just adapted so hard. What do you think uh, Blood Swarm's done to make this hard comeback? Like, what do you think he's done against NKB to, you know, figure him out? So we saw a couple of Shoryu baits uh, because NKB had been pretty much on his Shoryu game, uh, not taking any of the mix-ups, uh, doing uh, autocorrect DPs at the right time, uh, and had really been playing a really good close game against Blood Swarm, uh, whether that be giving up the advantage up close, uh, not conf oh man. Yep. And then do again, it. once Blood Swarm went on the offensive, just broke NKB for whatever reason. Um, make him afraid to throw those shore use and then get your pressure in for free. And with that, Blood Swarm will be sending NKB down to lose. We'll see him again uh, in one short round, but we have to hop down oh, to losers semis right now. So we're gonna hop on down to losers semis, which will make this again a best of. Um, three instead of five. All right, all set. Drop out. Uh, and for those of you who are just joining us, I'm going to show the bracket for just a moment. Uh, we just watched this match between MKB and Bloodswarm. We're going to have uh, Spababin and Zeta Zeta. Uh, the Zeta Zeta, that birdie player, who's made his hell of a trip here in the loser side of the bracket. Um, he lost to Blood Swarm, so perhaps he'll get his, uh, his revenge, the salty run back, if he can make it all the way back to Grand Finals. 
Uh, Spabobbin also trying to do the same, so we, oh man, they want blood. They're out for blood here. Everyone in Loser's side has lost a blood swarm tonight. How often does that happen? Uh, it's happened man. every week, Joe. Well, yeah. <laughs> you know what? Now, now that you mention it, you're actually not wrong. <laughs> so, everyone, though, everyone left in the losing side has lost to this man. Is Reddit free to fall? Maybe. I mean, you should probably join the tournament and find out. <laughs> <laughs> You've done quite well though in tournaments. It's not like you. I play underwater too. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Here in six. <laughs> Ooh, jump in hard punch. That's a weird button for Birdie. It works sometimes when he's looking for damage. Typically, you see him go for a hard kick. Just a weird button. Yeah, that's free punish. I'm like full screen. Birdie cannot get away with that in this matchup. Yeah, Spyro there is just too strong. I feel like this is a really bad matchup for Birdie. Because uh, he typically deals very poorly with... Uh, Oh, here comes the hot dog. You got a, a dumb hot dog on your head. <laughs> this, is oh. the dumbest, this is the dumbest one. Now let's it's, see if it stays on. No, when uh -oh. once they block a hit, it falls off. That'd be impressive because he, it's, uh, kept it on. It's really... really that one, like, does not fit at all. <laughs> okay, yeah. A lot of things in this game that don't fit, but it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. Ooh, get caught Tekken. Switching sides. Ooh, staying patient does not get shamed. And this... Ooh. It's not gonna kill. This actually might kill. This nope. might kill. Nah, nope. okay. I was gonna say, Kami does not have a lot of life. And he only got two hits in before that. It's not really gonna be scaled, but he wasn't gonna uh. be triggered, so we're gonna kill them. So, yeah. Overhead take. Zeta Zeta, preferring... Going for overhead quite a lot, and it has been doing him quite well uh, so far in this tournament. Uh, keep in mind, folks, this is Loser's Semis, which is a best of three. So Zeta Zeta now one, um, one set away from facing off against Bloodsworn here in... Well, no, NKB in uh, Loser's, Loser's Finals. Okay. I like that. I like that reset. It probably wasn't close enough to get the uh, stand light punch into light punch headbutt. So I just went for the stand light kick reset. Very smart. Something I actually don't see a whole lot of. Uh oh. We got confirms. Saw that you were in action with that bullhorn. Gotta get out of there. Locked. There we go. Gosh, this is so much damage to Cammy. Stop Cast backing up. Life. Uh-oh, no punish. I think I could probably just grab at that point. Uh-oh, okay. In it. Nope. Yeah, that's the thing. Once... If Brady can just whiff a stand like kick like that, his anti-air is really good right above his head. No jumps. This is a no jump zone. Gets the juggle. Look at all that damage. That's a two-hit juggle, and she's like dead. She's, she's like almost at half health. Yeah, that's the thing twice. that's... Oh, this is gonna the smash her. God, look at that. You see some bank robbers? Ooh, I don't Ooh, know if we're going not to... Quite. Not quite. But Bobby trying to make a comeback here on the ropes. Definitely on the ropes. <gasps> Ooh, that could have been it. A little bit of hitch. I don't know if that's on their side or just on my side, but... Oh, he uses that armor, but was safe. Oh no! Oh, Gets caught sitting, and Zeta Zeta will be moving on to losers finals against Never Knows Best, which we are just about to hop over to. Uh, let me actually do a little, a little refresh here, see if things have been. Sometimes later on in the tournament, yeah, that's that happens. People don't report their matches later on. Which I guess is fine. It's not really holding anything up if they're all here anyway. Back to queue. We've got Zeta Zeta and MKB already in here. Uh, Zeph has already dropped out. He does. He cares no longer. 
No, he doesn't. He has deserted us. I don't even know if he's in chat. He is not. He's not even in the chat. Wow. Can't even hear all the right. bad things I'm talking about him. Zeph's a very good dude. I think that he has been one hell of a TO in terms oh, of yeah, he what is he does just... and his ability to make matches happen. Uh oh. Top tier TO. Were they just not ready? That's weird. Good this time? Okay. Good to go. Okay. Well, this... Oh, damn it. Are you done set the match settings? I didn't. Yeah, it's alright. That's not too much of a delay. I done goofed. I made a goof. I made a goof by not changing the, the match Fight. settings. This is a best of five, a uh, best of three. Ooh, get baited. Giving up all that space. What's he want? He's just want Zeta, Zeta, Zeta to approach him. I guess that makes sense. I mean, Birdie's normals uh, definitely outplay Ken's, but Ken's walk speed is much better, and definitely his back walk speed. So if you can see him just walk right out of range, whatever normals. Just keep that range to it. Oh no. Oh no, you done goofed. That's some good awareness right there by uh, Zeta. Just keeping calm on that jump in. And NKB with a slight life heat lead here. How Ooh, that early sure you. Zeta Zeta in the corner. He's got a lot. NKB, a lot of room behind himself. Uh oh. How are you going to react to that online? Just stop blocking. Looks like he went airborne there. Right? Maybe tried to jump forward on block. Hard to say. Got hit with the fireball. Ooh, last hit there. Did not hit. Not safe. Not safe. I don't know why he's going for that. He has better, better meterless combos and do more damage. Oh well. Do more damage and leave him at same or better distance. Oh well. I'm not gonna think on that any longer. But Zeta Zeta got all the meter in the world here and just he spends it to get in. Right back in the corner. Here we go. Here's the pressure. Safe. The disrespect. Just throwing it out. Why not? But again, NKB with the disrespectful DP. Not good here. Nah, he jumps too slow. Get rid of it. God, he is getting away with so many DPs. I'm getting triggered over here. Ooh, getting... that reaction, though. You know. Yeah. You know he was. He was. Back and forth. Down forward, he down forward, down forward, down forward. All day. He just does not deserve like half of those DPs though. No, because he was just waiting for him. He was waiting for Zeta Zeta to press a button so that he could just hit medium punch. And he was already buffering that DP. So with anything uh. he would have done, the DP was going to come out anyway. That's actually a punish. It's not safe. Oh god, that anti air is so good. Step kick, actually pretty strong for Ken in this matchup. Just puts Birdie at the far end of the screen. When he has life lead like that, why not? Yeah, I was gonna say no cancel into into V trigger. Uh oh, that's good damage. And he gets the overhead. Double! Oh double. Overhead's so nice, he does it twice. Ooh, I like it. Oof, and I can't the overheads. Nah, no, that's not safe. It's not real. It's not real, folks. Oh. <laughs> but he got bad. a punish. That's like... Mm. See, like, when you empty jump like that, <laughs> the jab beat the hard punch DP. <laughs> 
Jump jab, man. Man, jump jab is so good. For a lot of characters, like jump jab and jump short for a lot of characters is like so strong and very underutilized. Ooh, didn't matter. That trade gets the stun and Zay. Ooh, all right, that's fine. Zayden Zay will be taking, uh, or at least keep himself safe. Keep in mind, folks, even though this is current match setting is set to best of three, this is actually best of five because we are in losers finals right now. The mind is that the players are to lose at home. Uh-oh, good cross up. Here we go. And again, where are your blocks at, son? Man, that's nah, not quite the round. So yeah, I can't really have a whole lot to to deal with at that or a lot to work with at that point. Only two bars. Good screen. No, it's just wait. Oh god. No, just do it. You know it's what? Like... If Zeta Zeta would have just blocked, he would have just had that round. But NKB doing what he is known best for. <laughs> Throwing out that DP. Why not? That was that was like really brave. It just no makes you think it's just like what can you do to beat that? I mean he's just buffering it and he's got such a hard knowledge on how to bust it out the right time. It's crazy. All right, do you want to drop down to... Yeah. All right. So, NKB, keep in mind, up two in the set. Uh, Zeta Zeta's got to go 3-0 and in order to move on to Grand Finals. Both of them looking for that salty run back against Bloodswarm, who is waiting in Grand Finals. Uh-oh. Uh, -oh. uh -huh. yeah, I don't know if they're going to know. I messed up. Alright, they're going now. I done goofed. Let's do this. MKB to it's zero. Um, yeah, they know. Yeah, I don't know why I'm trying to type this out. That's like a thing when like, I'm trying to like a weird thing about when you're commentating an online tournament is when they can just be listening to you at home. I never really know how much advice to give. Round one. Yeah, unless I mean, oh. unless there's a Zangief player in which I say I'll give him all the advice. You gotta be like corner coach for him at that point. Hell yeah. Anytime Slaying Man is on screen, I will be cheering for Zangief. That's all I'm talking about. Good anti-air, putting Ken in the corner now. Just waiting for it. Good patience. Good patience from Zeta Zeta. We got a bigger punish. Well, actually not really, because the next hit was going to stun anyway. There's overheads, though. Uh-oh. Is it over? That one hit? No. 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 Says Zeta Zeta. Trying oh, stay, no. Trying to stay alive here. Not going to DP his way out of this one. Or will he? He probably will, because, you know, what else is he going to do? Or That's like his trademark. He? Ooh. But, you know, it's got to be the last hit. It's got to be the one to win the set. That's really the only way it, it counts. I mean, he's or, pretty right now. He's up to in the set, in the series. Oh, my God. He's just... It's just that twitch reaction. If I were Zeta Zeta in a situation like that, Gosh, I don't know what you do, just like with a uh, crouching minion punch, something that doesn't like move your hurtbox forward very much. Because that's all MKB is looking for. He's looking for that for that counter hit or that whiff DP. Like I would just whiff like a crouching minion punch right there. Because yeah, he's you almost his hurtbox forward. Keeps him, yeah. stays very vertical. And if he's just looking for that twitch reaction. Yeah, you just gotta fake him out. Let him go flying. DP. Yes, yes. Yeah, you and can see resets. him. Yeah, you can see him try to work him over. It's not happening. Alright. Zeta Zeta got hit doing something. I don't know what it was. The uh, Link to Fireball, not a true block string, so. Kind of hit with it. Could have just blocked it. Actually, would have been punishment. 
Uh oh, working on a stun. Did you mess up? Did you goof? That'll do it. Won't have enough to kill, doesn't have enough meter or damage opportunities with nothing. Oh, I was gonna say, he kind of needs to cancel the V trigger there, but then he didn't. My goodness. Better know what he's doing. I was gonna say, he could probably DP that. That didn't look like it was at the correct range. Here comes the DP. Yeah, come on. Get real. Yeah, just DP. Finish it off. That is a punish, sir. And NKB sure you can his way into Grand Finals. Regardless of, of who won that, we were going to get the salty run back anyway. Uh, just for as many DPs as we're throwing out, I'm going to throw you the flex. I'm going to give you that. I'm going to give you that. Because they're not safe. And in a lot of the situations where you threw them out, it could have gone real bad. could have gone real bad for you. Uh, so we're going to have uh, Blood Swarm here join the lobby. And we will head right on into Grand Finals. Let me just ping. Grand Finals. Yeah. Join. guys look at the uh, the journey here as we were kind of closing things up we're kind of closing things up for the east coast tournament but we are about 30 minutes into the check-in for the west coast tournament um, oh, uh -oh. yeah no. yeah it's reporting the match here at the end that's fine do it later uh, but as you can see bloodsworn beat zeta zeta bloodsworn beats babobin bloodsworn beat nkb well, this one will need to beat NKB one more time in order to win tonight's tournament. Uh, we're about to get into that. Shh. Uh, Alan Carr, do you want to drop down for a second? Yeah. And if you're wondering how to join these tournaments or when to join these tournaments, these are, this is the weekly, this is every Monday, every Monday night, coming to you from our Street Fighter. This is the homepage of our Street Fighter. Uh, any tournament night, it'll be stickied right here at the top, uh, in one, one, two spot. Uh, and also for main events, we have this fun list over here, which looks all pretty with this new, new design. Or you can look over here in the events calendar and see what's coming up. As you can see listed every Monday, we've got the tournament listed. Uh, then what else? Uh, a whole bunch else. If you're look, if you're wondering where we're like holding these tournaments and communicating, all through the Discord, which you can reach through here. Or when you hop into this link, you can reach through here. Uh, and that will bring you to where you need to be if you want to join these tournaments. But right now, we have Grand Finals on our hands, folks. Got all white everything version 2 right now. Oh, this is a little, a little choppy. Wonder if it's just on. It's just on the spectating end. In terms of streaming, I'm still running it fine, but it's like the game is a little bit, a little bit hitchy. It could just be from a viewer perspective. Ooh, see those DPS. I don't know if they're gonna work that well. These parts, not in Fangville. Ooh, double shimmy. Ooh, good chase. Good chase that red button. That Tatsu from downtown taking care of those poison balls. I like it. Oops. I didn't. Sorry about that. Saving his life right there from that EX dot EX. Went for the throw. Uh, safe on block. All right, we got corner control here. Good patience. Didn't have to waste any. Oh, here comes Dange. Oh, he went for the reset to kill. I like it. Blood swarm up one. Keep in mind, folks, because this is. Grand Finals, um, Blood Swarm will, well, they're playing to a best of three or, or best of five, first to three. 
Sorry, getting tongue-tied. Oh boy, man. See, I think in the last sets we've seen NKB, he's been really relying off those, you know, those twitchy DPs, and it's just ain't gonna happen against Bloodswarm. Well, he can't. No, it, he can't continue to play from the range that he's playing at. Um, he needs to play it a little bit closer. Know when he? I mean, he knows the punishes there. He's had trouble with this matchup for a while. This is not the first time that he's played it, and not the first time that he's lost to Bloodsworn. In a final scenario, I did, to, not to mention. Um, he's at least got his practice in. I know he wants to play against Penguin, even though Penguin does play a little bit different from Bloodsworn. Um, I know Penguin, is he still in the chat? I don't think so. No, he is. Might ask him how he feels about this matchup. How do you feel about this matchup? Uh, I feel pretty good. Actually, um, Ken does a lot more damage, but uh, Fong has a lot of tricky tools and a better neutral. This so is true. it is much harder for Ken to get in and start his Ken games. Uh, and then how do you also do you feel use of V trigger uh, to be spent on V reversal or saved? Um, I am not a good person to ask that because I never V reversal ever. Oh, you don't crab walk? You don't you don't show me the Zoid bird? Nah, I've been I've been OS too many times to even bother anymore, which is a bad mentality to have. Lots of them just doing work right now. Oh, that Ooh. oh, that's so pretty. That was neato. It's really pretty I didn't remember because that it one. gives him a really nice meaty setup. Oh my goodness, Lots of God, that break dancing on the fool. Get good. I want to see. I'm, I'm gonna need that replay tomorrow morning. It'll go up. Someone. Get someone give it, please. All these replays go up. The they'll be there next tomorrow morning. Um, at some point, I'll say when exactly. But uh, all the replays will go up on the YouTube channel. Um, be posted to our Street Fighters sometime tomorrow morning. Ooh, he's a light kick. He's got confidence that he'll dodge that. Oh no! I, cl I clipped oh, it for you. No, you clip. Okay, thanks. Thanks, Clippy. I got y'all. I see you. Ooh. Right no DPs here. Alright, NKB trying to make a comeback. Really down on on rounds here. On the brink of elimination. I just gave him all that room to work with. Uh, see, I, that's uh, I don't know. He's got the life lead, but I don't think Ken should really be trying to back off once he's like inside of like Stan Harkin. Oh. Yo, jump in so he life. We got cross-ups. Ooh, comebacks. We got cross-ups. I like it. I like it. Getting cheeky with that mix-up. There's not a whole lot that Fawn can do. Uh, he doesn't have an invincible reversal without his critical light. He could get out with his EX uh, command dash, but he didn't have the meter for it. Uh, but even so, even then, oh, just like that meter build. And then that time dashes right into throw range. Very cheeky from Bloodsworn. I like it a lot. Oh, we got corner carry. How are you gonna shimmy and then get shimmy and get thrown yourself? Fog's throw range is bad. How'd that even happen? Just stay on the ground. <laughs> got up a little bit too early that time. Got counted. Probably out of poison ball. I don't know why he's back dashing after the, the light rebend. You can advance on following after blocking it. You don't have to worry about that. It's negative. Oof. Taking the poison. He's waiting. Taking the poison. He's waiting on that DP. NKB Waiting for it to come out. To come back. Got shimmied this time. Fong, though, not a whole lot of resources to do a whole bunch more damage. If it just needs the mix up one more time, here we go. No. Veer versus staying safe. Done with the pressure. Oh. Where your punish at? Could have chased down, went with the wrong button. If you would have pressed hard punch, yep. would have won it. Would have taken it. Would have at least NKB sent this into round stole. three. Yeah. NKB staying alive here in stole the it. grand finals. He done stole it. Oh, 
one. Fight. Here we go. Now the range on that crazy. That seems pretty good. Good range. Ooh. Oh man, very close to getting the chain. Walked back a little too far for that to work. Nope. Disrespect. Get out of town. Good tech and then a back throw in the corner. Bad place for MKB to be. Man, it's crazy how these throws he's pulling off. The the range on Fong's throws is not that good. And even though you see him walk back, he's out of out of range of some normals. Get it's all about just knowing knowing that optimal range. Tries Getting to the feel. To jump. Yo, you really gonna let this guy chicken walk all over you? You let him dance? You gonna dance? Uh oh, time to take the poison. Alright, I feel like Blood Swarm is feeling it right now. Absolutely feeling it. When you dance on someone like that, when you stepping on a beach, <laughs> when you doing that all day for free, here we go, stepping on a beach. <clears throat> oh, we got cross ups. Cross up poison pots, and he's got the meter to cancel into it. Uh oh. Poison pot didn't jump like he wanted. Ooh, oh, oh, that could have been it. Yeah, just that sweep sent him in the wrong direction. Oh, no. Taking the poison. One jab away. You're not going to recover that great health. It's all gone. Yep, that'll do Two it. positive got hit standing in it. Blood Swarm will be taking it tonight. He is our winner uh, for the East Coast Casual Tournament. This has been the R Street Fighter Weekly Casual Tournament. I am Joe Monday. Shoutouts to Zeph as TO. Shoutouts to Encore for holding it down here in the chat. Shoutouts to Penguin for making the release new and uh, having that fun little little giveaway during the second half of the show. Much appreciated. If you can chime of in, our man, our man in the field. Uh, so yeah. Hopefully you have a good night tonight, sir. Um, Shoutouts to everyone who turned up for tonight's tournament. Uh, but if you're watching from the West Coast, hang out in the Discord and. Look for the tournament announcements. They should be 20 minutes away from wrapping up their check-in. So I'm going to head into the chat to try and figure out the uh, best way to help there. Uh, but if you're looking for the tournaments, we run this every night. Last Monday of every month is a... That's your money match. $5 entry fee. All the money goes directly towards the winners. Um, which... Uh, Last week there was a pretty good turnout. We're gonna try and kick this one, this next one in overdrive. There's some fun to be had with that. Big money getting paid out. Uh, but that will do it for us tonight. Stay tuned on the sub. Lots of things coming this week. Lots of fun stuff. Lots of fun announcements coming. Uh, but that will do it for us tonight on the East Coast. You take care out there on the West Coast. Keep it classy. San Diego. I can actually say keep class San Diego because there are people I happen to know specifically there's people in San Diego who are playing. Anyway, have a good night folks. Take care.